Hi friends, in this video we can discuss about the groups and axes in order 15. For that I am using this school management module. Inside this module I just added a security folder. Under the security folder I just added ir.models.access.csv file to provide the necessary access for the uh, user groups. So currently I just listed the all the models used in this module. So school.student and I am provided the um, permission for the base.group user as read, write and create and link permission. So we can now check how to create a user group like this and how we can provide a access for the user group for that i just created a security.xml file before that we can go to the auto ui and we can check the user group if we enable the debug mode we can see a option of groups we can click on that we can see the uh, currently we can see the model as rest.groups in the url and we can search for the uh, rest.groups in the in our source code rest.groups and here we can see an example of the um, security group we can just copy this and we can paste here and we can um, uh, rename this id we can uh, provide the And if we need to uh, provide any description for this field, we can uh, uh, provide from here or we can just remove this. We can, um, we can change the uh, sequence to name and we can provide the um, module name here. Let's go management and from here we can uh, change the id and inside this uh, we can create um, a new record for the student and we can uh, provide it, provide the reference of this category so we need to um, so we can copy this id sorry we can just copy this and we can paste here with the module name just copy this So we can uh, rerun the PyCharm and upgrade the module. We can check that. Under the groups, we can search for the school management. We can see a um, new group school management slash student so we can see the new uh, group is created we can add a um, 
we can add the user from here. I'm just adding the mark demo from here. Save. So this way we can create a user group. And next, next we can check how we can provide an access for this user group. So we can go to the CSV file. Currently, I just added the base dot group user permission for these models. So we can change that. And we can uh, copy this module name dot we can copy the record ID. We can provide the um, user group like this and we can change the access from here I am just uh, currently I am just providing as a only read permission so um, 1 comma 0 comma 0 comma 0 sorry And before that, I'm just creating a creating some records in this module. And now we can rerun the PyCharm and we can upgrade this module. After upgrading this module, we can see the school management module menu is disappeared from disappeared from the app list for Michelle Admin. Currently, we don't we didn't set the permission for the Michelle Admin. We can uh, just log out and we can log in as demo. We can see the school management menu, and uh, we can see currently the student has a only read permission so we um, set the permission for the mark demo as a student so we can uh, check that currently we have no create and edit button so this way we can create a user group and we can provide the access for the user group like this. I hope you got the idea about this. Thank you for watching.